As kids, we all have grown up watching all kinds of magic and illusions. The magicians have their secrets which they never share and that's what makes their magic shows a treat to watch. Maybe as a child we were too involved in the magic and didn't care much about the secrets. But not anymore. Hello and welcome back to Fact of Fusion. Today we'll be revealing some of the greatest magic secrets of all time. But before we do that, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you get instant notification of our new video uploads. So let's get started. At number 5, Lean Back Levitation. We all remember the iconic magic scene which was quite incredible. Here you can see Dynamo, the famous magician who is performing this amazing trick with quite ease. He leans back slowly till his body becomes parallel to the surface. Then he raises his left leg in air and then all of a sudden gets back up without any problem. Ever wondered how Dynamo performed this gravity defying trick? Well, here's the secret. And it is all hidden in a specially designed shoe which has a heel that locks into the pegs on the floor. To support his full leg, the heel is connected to a steel framed dual leg brace that locks out when he's just about parallel to the surface. This locking mechanism combined with the heel mechanism supports his body weight and shifts its center of gravity away from his upper body. This allows him to stay balanced while leaning backwards at an impossible angle. Once he feels him being supported and balanced by his right leg, he lets everyone know that he's suspended in the mirror and then slowly lifts his left leg. The interesting part here is, Dynamo lifts his left leg straight out. It actually helps him balance by shifting the center of gravity even further towards his leg. In this trick, he also makes sure his pants are long enough to prevent any exposure of the steel frame attached to his leg. After impressing the girls with his matrix stunt, he slowly and steadily gets up. Act number 4 Identical Twins Magic Act Tony and his twin brother Jordan once performed an amazing magic trick that brought the America's Got Talent judges and the audience to their feet. The rack combined the power of magic and technology. Here's what they did. Tony began the trick by stepping behind a giant screen he brought onto the stage. Then all of a sudden he appears on the screen. On screen he splits himself into two, making the audience realize that they are not just looking at Tony but also his identical twin brother Jordan. From there on, Tony and Jordan work together on stage to perform amazing cool interactive stuff on the screen as you can see here. Now, the interactive stuff of the act is quite obvious to understand. They just have a video playing on the big screen and the twin brothers don't really interact with the screen or affect what is happening on it. Before this act, they had just practiced hard enough to make sure exactly what they need to do on the stage thus creating the illusion that they are interacting with the screen. So, a lot of tricks performed in a very short time and we'll be revealing this following key secrets. Turning napkins to red dress after the girl appears on the screen, Tony and Jordan shoot red napkin like cloth at her. The red napkin flies to the screen and becomes a red dress on the girl. How is this done? Well, they don't really shoot the napkin at her. The real napkin actually disappears into the sleeves as soon as they let go of them with one hand. This is done using a gimmick called Checo, which pulls the napkin using elastic band into the sleeves. At the same moment, two red cloths appear on the screen, fly towards the girl and transform into a dress. Basically, everything happens on the screen. All Tony and Jordan have to do is to release the napkins at the right moment to create the visual illusion that they are shooting the napkins onto the screen. Lighting up the bulb Tony never lit that up. It was just the video playing on the screen which made the illusion of bulb lighting up. Also you can see how he gets rid of the bulb behind his bookshelf. The balloon illusion At one point, 
Jordan takes a yellow balloon and hands it over to the girl on the screen. If you look at the video closely, you can actually see the balloon is hand exploding and the piece is falling to the floor. This explains how he makes the balloon disappear by picking it up. At the same time, the balloon appears in the on-screen video. The twin girls appearing on the stage. If you pause the video, you can see this small cupboard to the right of the screen where the girls are actually hiding. Before they appear, you can also see how Jordan conceals the view with the blanket which enables the girls to crawl from behind the cupboard towards the middle of the stage. At number 3, James Moore's Sword Stabbing Trick James Moore once performed a great sword trick on Britain's Got Talent where he got himself strapped. First, the assistant placed James on the tip of the sword and left him. Few seconds later, the sword goes through his body, leaving the viewers and judges completely in shock. The two helpers then lifted him off the sword and he was alright. The trick generated quite a buzz and puzzled millions who couldn't believe how he has done it. Well, here's the secret. James had a special support on his back, hidden under his clothes. And also he has a small slot to hold the sword in it. Now, when the assistant placed him on the top, the sharp tip of the sword falls and is hidden inside the bottom part and then enters the hole in the support. This makes James balance in the air. At the same moment, a fake sword appears from his stomach, which is a device that creates the illusion of a sword going straight through him. Wasn't it shocking? At number 2, Split Man Trick. This incredibly cruel magic trick is scaring hell out of the people with the body cut in half. If that's what you think, well, it's just a prank and you can too perfect it. Here's the secret. The split man illusion only works when you watch the performer from the front. But if you were to look from behind or even from the side, you'll notice that the performer is actually pulling off an incredibly awkward stance to make the illusion work. And it is clear that from his knees to the waist, it is actually a plastic mannequin created using baggy clothes and few other items. A right body posture and the costume create the perfect illusion of a man holding his own leg with one of his hands. Finally you have it, the man cut in half who is able to fully walk with his handmade costume and make it look that much more believable. Now before we move on to reveal the final trick, in our previous magic video we had asked you whether the water you see suspended is fake or real. The answer is quite obvious, it's a fake trick. Scientifically, to stay water suspended in the air, it requires a rigid object. A spin motion does make things stable, but this is usually for rigid objects, not for fluids. Also, this video is low definition and a few camera tricks and effects make it seem more believable. You will try it multiple times and fail, not because it is fake, it's just not possible. And now, the final trick in our video. Act number 1. Produce car out of thin air Have you ever seen a magician produce cards out of thin air? It's one of those tricks where the move is so cool that it looks so spectacular. And do not be fooled by the simplicity of this trick. It is very visual and can be real reputation maker if you perfect it. The only thing you need is pack of cards and a lot of patience day in, day out. Well, here's the secret. The magician places the card behind his hand on the back of his palm and gently opens his first finger and the little finger then closes it with a very slight bow in the card. This is the first position where the audience thinks that the hand is empty. He then closes his hand and pushes his thumb onto the card as it sits on the nails of his middle and ring finger. Finally, he slides his nails out so that he's holding the card with the pads of his middle and ring finger. He pulls this trick off by increasing his hand movements to show both sides of his hand without flashing the card. As you can see here, the magician performs this trick with a great speed and the height is such that it hides any flashes of the card moving from back to front and then back again, thus making the card appear out of thin air. So do you like this trick? How would you perform if given a pack of cards? Did it work out for you? Post your comments below and let us know your thoughts. Now that you know the amazing card trick, watch this carefully. And tell us how he get that card onto his mouth. We'll be revealing this secret in our next magic video. 
So guys, these were some of the best magic secrets finally revealed. Are there any other magic tricks you'd like us to reveal? Tell us in the comments and we'll definitely jump onto them. Like and share this video with your friends on social media. They probably would like to know how these tricks were done. For more such amazing things, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. And finally, thanks for watching.